Cocaine found in the White House. The Secret Service now confirms the white powder found in the West Wing on Sunday. Yes, it is cocaine. The agency's drug test reaching the same conclusion as a preliminary test from first responders. The Secret Service trying to pinpoint right now who brought that cocaine into the one of the most secure buildings on the planet. And this morning, we have new reaction from former President Trump, who's alleging it is no mistake the drugs were found in the president's orbit. White House correspondent Allison Harris has the latest. Allison. Hey, good morning, Marky. Good morning to you, Adrian. The White House press secretary says she doesn't want to get ahead of the Secret Service, which is leading this investigation. But President Biden has been briefed on this. The cocaine was found near cubby holes where tourists leave their phones before going on tours of the West Wing. They leave their phones and their belongings there. The press secretary, Karine Jean-Pierre, she calls it a heavily traveled area and says that there were tours happening on Friday, Saturday and Sunday when that was found. On those tours, people are able to see the Oval Office, the Cabinet Room and even the Roosevelt Room. It could take weeks to test this bag for cocaine, to test it for fingerprints. And it could even still then be difficult to find who this bag of cocaine belonged to. Reports state that authorities are also analyzing visitor logs from Sunday when that substance was found and looking through surveillance video as well. Again, this is under the purview of the Secret Service. But a couple of things that I would add is that White House is subject uh, to rigorous guidelines that include drug testing. And uh, so we will take any action uh, is, that is appropriate and warranted pending the outcome of the Secret Service. But the fact that this investigation is still pending is not stopping conservatives and critics from coming up with theories about what they think happened, how they think that this cocaine made its way to the West Wing. Former President Trump suggesting that there must be some kind of connection to Hunter Biden, who has struggled with addiction. Senator Tom Cotton has also sent a letter to the Secret Service demanding answers for the American people on how this cocaine made its way into the White House as a member of the House Oversight Committee is saying that they plan to request a briefing from the Secret Service on this. Adrian. All right, Allison, thank you very much. For thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.